Hello there. We at Admin Health Server Technologies are proud to announce the release of Firewall Interface Plus version 2.0.2. Our Firewall Interface extension has a GUI to manage APF CSF from inside Parallel Plus. Even though Plus has its own Firewall module, having additional support of APF CSF will definitely make your life easier when it comes to firewall management. With this extension, you can manage your firewall from inside the Plus panel. Let's go ahead and check the extension by logging into Plusk interface. On the left sidebar, click on extensions and under the extension catalog, you will find a number of choices of Plusk extension. Herein, you can search and find the admin ahead firewall interface Plusk extension. Make sure to select the extension with the logo that is being displayed on the screen right now. Click on the buy button to complete the purchase. From the extensions catalog, you can install the Firewall Interface Plus by Vendor Admin Head Server Technologies. Enter the license key that you have received from Admin Head to proceed with the installation. Now as Firewall Interface has been installed and activated, let's go deeper into the working of the extension. On the home page, there are four tabs that are displayed. Rules, Configuration, Ports and Settings. Now let's go ahead and check the settings tab. When you click on the settings tab, you will be notified if you already have a firewall installed or else you can go ahead and select CSF or APF firewall which is available on this page. In case any other firewall is installed, you will have to uninstall the existing firewall. When the existing firewall is uninstalled, you will be given the option to either install config serve firewall or advanced policy firewall. After you click on the option you require, you will have to wait for a few minutes for the installation to complete. Once done, on the settings page the selected firewall will be displayed and you will have the option to switch on or off the firewall and you will also have an option to restart CSF or APF. Now let's go ahead and check the ports tab. On the ports page you can manually enter the inbound and outbound TCP and UDP ports. You can enter the required ports by clicking on the pencil icon shown on the right side of the screen. Now let's go ahead and check the configuration tab. On this page you have the option to make advanced setting changes. Once done, click on the update and restart button. Now let's go ahead and check the rules tab. On this page you have the option to add, edit or remove rules. In order to view, edit or delete any given rules that have been entered, click on the checkbox shown on the left side of the screen next to the corresponding rule and select the desired icons displayed on the right side of the screen. In order to add a new rule, click on the add new rule button on the top right hand side. Once this is done, a window pop-ups. Fill in the required details and once done, click on the submit button. That's all folks, we have now finished going through Firewall Interface Plus version 2.0.2 for Plusk by Admin Ahead Server Technologies. Thank you for watching this video. 
If you would like to know more about the plugin, please open a support ticket and we will be happy to help you out. Thank you and have a great day.